Pennsylvania is making more forms of naloxone available. This is the opioid overdose reversal medication. And this is an update to the state physician general's order that pharmacies make naloxone available without a prescription. Sonica Bargo joins us with those details. Sonica. Alicia, the new form is an injectable option which comes with vials of the medication. Officials say they want to make naloxone as easily accessible and easy to use as possible. Naloxone um, can save a life. An effort to get life-saving medicine into everyone's hands. You really don't know when you're going to encounter someone who it might be experiencing an overdose. And so we just have to be ready at all times. Pennsylvania Physician General Dr. Denise Johnson is urging pharmacies to carry different forms of naloxone. We've also added a higher dose nasal spray. Naloxone can reverse an opioid overdose. Under Johnson's standing order, pharmacies have to dispense it without a prescription, including a new injectable form. Non pre filled syringe with vials. Johnson says she wants to make getting and using naloxone as easy as possible. The injectable is sort of like an EpiPen, and so some people are used to using that. If people have easy access to it, they'll come get it. If they have to call in or go get a prescription, do whatever, it's going to make it a little more difficult. Chuck Cray owns Hershey Pharmacy, one of the many locations you can get naloxone. All they need to do is come into the pharmacy. But he has a more personal connection. His nephew struggled with addiction. Has had multiple bouts with uh, having to use the uh, naloxone to save his life. Now he's in recovery. Now uh, working, engaged, uh, clean for a couple of years. Cray says that's what naloxone does. It gives people time. It's not going to cure that uh, underlying need that they have, but it's going to give them time to deal with it and to outgrow it. You really can't enter recovery um, if you don't survive your overdose. An easy way to access naloxone is to get it at your local pharmacy. Most insurance companies will cover the cost. If you don't have health insurance, you can get it for free in the mail or through some community organizations. In the studio, Sonica Barco, ABC 27 News. Thank you, Sonica.